Hi, this is uh, Stéphane Francois. Thank you for joining Halcon 11 Fast Track Tutorial 1. Get Halcon for free. So we we'll start by downloading or accessing the file from the website. So you just have to go to mvtech.com. You can go directly even here on download. And then you have two choices. The full version where you have to register and you can register yourself with, this, with that link here. Um, it's fairly uh, fast process, uh, but you want to stay uh, anonymous uh, in trying the demo. Uh, you can use this one, the demo version. Um, so here, just click and uh, you can choose which version you want, Windows, Linux or Mac OS. Uh, I have Windows here, you notice. Uh, uh, so, so the file is 1.1 gig uh, compared to uh, 1.3 gig with the uh, full version. Um, so I'm going to try that one, I already tried the other one, I'm curious with that one. So let's save and let's go back once we done. Okay, the download is now finished. Let's run the executive. Run the file. So this is with Windows Vista and Windows 7 now. Uh, there's this authorization. We need to be administrator. So unpacking. So now I guess we don't need the web page. Okay, so setup, uh, usual agreement. So you can choose which one. Uh, I think that by default you would uh, install the two, but we can. Uh, so that we want to have the uh, x86, uh, the um, regular version. So here this is what we can uh, request. Um, so we can have the two installed. Um, just to make sure the examples, everything there is good. So depending on your language, you can choose uh, what you want. So English in my case. Selection of the destination folder. So for Vista and higher, so Windows 7, so there is now uh, this selection we have to make uh, to see if we have put it to put all the example, meaning all the files that we could be uh, modifying uh, should be in a, another directory or folder than uh, the uh, exe files or the uh, in some way system files of uh, Halcon. Uh, so this is the preferred uh, way for the US version of Windows. Uh, so we continue like this. So in the uh, uh, demo version, demo installation, uh, there is a, a bit less uh, choices. There is no, nothing about the licensing. Um, so that makes it a bit more straightforward. So uh, the installation is going to take a little bit, I guess. 1.1 uh, gig, I guess, is going to take a little bit of time. So uh, I'll be shortening it. Okay, the installation is now complete. Um, so we can leave it the way it is right now. Let's say finish. So, uh, the README here, I'm a bit curious to see what um, it's provided or what it contains. So, some information about the demo version. Uh, the, so, it has limitations. Uh, program cannot be saved. Um, so, it can be modified. So, we can modify the scripts, uh, but it cannot be modi uh, uh, saved. So, meaning that uh, everything, all the modifications are good. 
uh, until you close Edge Develop or, uh, of course, um, when you turn off your PC. But as long as this is on, then it's still uh, inside the software. So uh, that's at least interesting to try I mean, for free. That's always interesting. Uh, image acquisition interfaces are not supported, so we cannot import from any frame grabber or uh, network cameras like a USB gigi cameras. So it's not possible to do. Uh, I know that there is a way to get some. I did one, so it's possible to use the um, the, the socket. Uh, is possible to use in a demo version. Um, so that would be one way of getting data in. Um, there's a reminder of the uh, pop-up reminder uh, every 100 executed operators. Um, yeah, that's a bit constraining, I would say. Uh, and also the, the 10 seconds, so which one uh, arrived first. So there's no access through the DLL, so just from uh, Edge Develop. And uh, the documentation is not completely provided. Uh, we will see the difference when uh, I do the regular version, I guess. Uh, because the regular download does has also the demo version. Okay, some word about the Excel and uh, getting started. So I'll let you read this uh, if you'll be interested. The idea is to go a bit faster. So this is installed and uh, now we can just check what's going on. So we have to look in the list and Alcon 11 is here. So we have the Edge Develop, the 32 and 64 bit. Uh, readme release notes uninstalled and this is after the interesting things might be there so uh, we can have a quick look here tutorials uh, the example so this is a shortcut on some example although I don't recommend this I'm going to show you where and uh, documentation uh, is probably the most interesting things uh, at the beginning uh, one will be the installation guide. Uh, will be very interesting uh, to to learn, but probably not in the first place, especially if you don't have any problem with the installation. So that should be fine if you're running the demo. Uh, but if you'll be interested in running uh, the regular version, the, this file will be uh, very. Uh, interesting, especially if you want to buy your license. So, so here you have uh, that section uh, about Alcon licenses, where you are going to learn uh, how it would work. Uh, so it would be better to be informed before you you buy, I guess. Um, so that's one file, and of course the other one. Uh, okay, I have to go back there. Alcon 10 uh, documentation and. Uh, uh, of course, there's a quick guide um, that would be interesting. And the solution guide, I think that should be one of the most important parts uh, of what is provided, even in that demo version, will be all those solution guides. And I do recommend you to have a look at them. Uh, so they are organized by a section. You can see the basics, uh, image acquisition, matching, data code. So whatever you're going to engage into. Uh, for example, if you're going to do 3D vision, uh, I recommend that you, you have a look at all that document. It's, it's pretty well done. And it gives you a very good background of the technology uh, provided in Halcon and also um, how it's applied and how it works. Uh, background information about uh, the the 3D coordinates and uh, the pauses and etc. So the, the matrix rotation, blah blah blah. So it's a, it's very necessary in order to really understand um, how it's applied in Halcon. And uh, what is the foundation that uh, they are using in order to do anything? So here, the 3D pause is a very important thing uh, if you're going to do 3D to understand how it works or how it works in Halcon.
So it has to be a good way to learn uh, all the details, calibration, and, and all kind of details that you can see here. Um, you know, the uh, vision with stereo system and uh, binocular stereo vision, laser triangulation, shade of light, uh, depth from focus. Uh, so uh, anything that is 3D will be in that document. So it's a fairly long document. Uh, if you look at the end, uh, we are at uh, pa page uh, 262. So it's fairly, fairly long document uh, talking about different aspects. So I do recommend you to um, to look at those documentation. Uh, that will be it for uh, this uh, tutorial 1, uh, we'll go into more in depth in uh, version 2.